Welcome to your reading for September 26, 2020. Please show me what everyone can know here or see. Thank you. Sorry for the noise. There's some work going on outside. I hope everyone's doing great. All right. Let's see. Chaos in the upright. <laughs> That's funny. I knew based on the song that this card was going to come up. Um, this, I think, is this is going to be a community reading for sure. Um, something about the collective. Just based on the song, it was. Um, it's called "The Community of Hope" by P. J. Harvey, and it felt like um, like a call to. I'm not going to say arms, but a call to stand together. And this is a card of hope. This is a card of um, saying that there is hope. And it's also about a man. I think in this case, men. Um, I know I feel this way. I want the men in our society to step up, to um, stop following um, corrupt orders. Um, so that's what this feels like to me. And... Um, it feels like we're getting to a place where we either are standing up or we're um, hoping that our, our brothers and sisters will stand up, if that's what I'm getting there. And that um, this is also a shock to the system. Um, definitely implies something shocking. Um, but it also implies that there is hope. This, to me, implies that it's kind of like a slow, um, well, let's call it a slow boil, you know, like the, the frog that slowly boils to death. <clears throat> I think that we're at that point where we're like trying to get out of the pot, um, some of us more than others. Um, in the how, <laughs> three of wands in the reverse, which is literally called um, getting out of jail, if you translate that ancient French, um, and I'm not going to try and say that. So, yeah, we're taking action. Wow, this is um, going to be a strong reading, I think. Holy crap. Okay, in the Y, we have the tower in the reverse. So, to me, this looks like things are turning upside down. That there are definitely um, people among our community who are standing up and they're they're kicking off the shackles and they're digging their way out. This is also um, suggesting to me that it's it's a past event which I think has happened. We've just been um, somewhat slow at connecting the dots and figuring out what's happening. Um, Wow. So something is going to happen this week, for sure. How we're going to feel. Page of Wands, vying for something. Um, it could be, it could be a protest. We're definitely trying to come out of this. Um, this suggests looking good, presenting well, um, looking out to the world having this, some kind of destruction behind us. Trying to create some kind of order, but being a novice at it. To me, this, this looks like people trying to escape something. That's what that looks like to me. And then trying to regain some kind of order starting something new. Broken contract. The Grand Priest in the reverse is in the advice. So, because this felt so community-minded to me right from the start, I am going to, my first thought is to find your, your sovereign oneness. Find your how do I put this? Break your contra contract with 
I'm just going to say the government. This is also suggesting a new contract in the future. Oh, almost took the wrong card. Bottom of the deck. Seven of Swords in the reverse. <laughs> wow, so that is past deception, lying, betrayal. So breaking a deceptive contract is how I'm seeing this. I'll try to look at this at a more personal level as well. But yeah, because of the song. And I couldn't even really hear a lot of the words because I was shuffling. Um, but yeah, it really, it, it sounded like it was not very happy with the status quo, that's for sure. And, and I'm in agreement. I'd, I'll have to listen to it again. So to me, this is suggesting something. Um, finding faith in, in our fellow people our fellow tribesmen. Definitely wanting people to stand up and escape from... It, it also suggests that um, escaping from something that is no longer even relevant, like the system is falling on its own, and there are still people that are trying to cling to it because, you know, the out... It's scary when you go out and start something new and you don't know what you're doing. You're, you know, you're, you're using a lot of calories there trying to figure out what to do. But you do get, you, you do figure it out. And you, you even do it with style. You use this as some kind of learning element, I think. Because this is an apprentice. This is someone, someone getting a new job, getting a new role, but first, you have to learn how to survive or something. Your advice is definitely to break the contract. And because it was so community-minded, it makes me think of um, your sovereign... Oh, I don't know how to put it. Your sovereign status. Find your sovereign status. Like, find... You might even have to meditate on it to, um, and this is also starting something new. Um, definitely release this this um, deceptive element. For some of you, you're getting a divorce from someone who has been very deceptive. That could be the tower moment as well, and you're escaping from some kind of controlling. Um, element. Someone could have uh, been a cheater as well. You felt like you had to um, compete for this person's attention, maybe. Um, for some of you, this person, if, if you're a woman and, and you're leading somebody that was deceptive and you're starting out new and you're, you know, figuring out the ropes, um, and you're starting something new after you break this contract, you, um, you might be entering into some other kind of contract in the, in the future. Actually, this is hope, so you're hoping to. Um, but just to make this more confusing, um, this suggests hope for somebody that you're divorcing. Maybe um, this does feel a little bit healing down here, um, but the advice is to break the contract. But maybe on a friend level or something, maybe this person has learned because this does suggest some kind of um, enlightenment for a man in your life or if you're a man for you. And you might be escaping something that was dragging you down. And uh, so maybe we're all in some way starting something new this week and we're a little bit, we're not very sure-footed yet. We might be um, complaining as well. But back to the community thing, I think we're all sick of this 
deceptive contract that we've had with um, with our rulers and we want something new and we're hoping for something new something better all right that was the reading for today and your shuffle song again the community of hope by tj hardy all right love you guys bye